In the team's first season of being a member of the Pacific 8 Intercollegiate Hockey Association, also known as the Pac-8, the San Jose State men's ice hockey team geared up for its first taste of Pac-8 playoff hockey. After a season of ups and downs, including losing the team's head coach of six years and losing five important seniors to graduation, the Spartans were able to punch their ticket to playoffs with an in-conference record of 6-6, six and six, a total of 12 points. The Spartans joined the Pac-8 last offseason along with four other teams, expanding the conference to 12 clubs. Those 12 clubs make up two divisions within the conference, the North and the South. The Spartans finished third in the South Division and sixth overall. The winner of the Pac-8 will not only be crowned champion, but will also make it to regional play out in Arizona with the top 15 teams from the West Division of the ACHA Division II later this month. As the Spartans arrive in South Lake Tahoe, it was time to get ready for the season banquet just down the street from the Spartans Hotel. All eight teams who made the Pac-8 playoffs were in attendance, and the captains of each team were encouraged to give a recap of their season. Corey, I'm the captain and president of the SJSU hockey team. Uh, first of all, I just want to say thank you to AJ and the whole Pac team for putting this together. It's going to be a really cool weekend. Um, this is also like San Diego. This is our first year in the Pac, so we're really excited to, to be out here and to be able to represent our school here. A uh, little story about us. It's not really anything funny or anything, but we're kind of going through a transition year. We actually just let go of our coach um, of like seven years, uh, so we're in a bit of a transition period here, and we lost some of our some of our like franchise players, I guess as you call them. So. We have some of our young guys coming up, but we're really excited about the future and excited about what we can do in the pack. Thanks, guys. So then the focus shift to the following evening where the Spartans would face off against the Eastern Washington Eagles in what would be both teams' first appearance in Pac-8 playoffs. And it was finally time for the team to make the short drive down the road to South Lake Tahoe Ice Arena to prepare for battle. <laughs> The Spartans made it to South Lake Tahoe for their first taste of Pac-8 playoff action. Their first test, the Eastern Washington Eagles. As the team made their way onto the ice, it didn't take long for Eastern Washington to get on the board. Where the Spartans dropped both those games out in Torrance, suburb of Los Angeles. And now, up ice with it come the Eagles entering the zone. Here's Lucero, shot, scores! The score remained 1-0 until the latter stages of the second period, where the Eagles would net two more and go up by three goals. And despite exceptional goaltending from Willie Chan, the Spartans would be blanked by one of the best goaltenders in the league, Tyler O'Donnell. As it ends 4-0 in favor of Eastern Washington. They'll move on to play Cal tomorrow at 4 p.m. in the semifinal. Winner of that will move on to the finals on Sunday. And that does it for the Spartans season that ends here in Lake Tahoe at the hands of the Eastern Washington Eagles. Once reality set in that, in fact, the season was over for the Spartans, the team spent a couple extra days up in the mountains to celebrate the roller coaster of a season and look forward to next fall.